Virtual Bible School. We're having such an awesome time. We hope you are at home. And as every day we say, it's Sunday! kids and welcome to virtual bible school it is day four we are having such an awesome time at virtual bible school i hope you are at home and today we're gonna learn about prayer that's right you're gonna learn something called the lord's prayer and the bottom line today is that you can pray about anything anytime and anywhere. That's right. You can pray to God anytime about anything and anywhere. And to help us with this lesson today, we're going to do our memory verse. Here we go. Memory verse. Memory verse. Memory verse. Memory verse. Let us keep looking to Jesus. Yeah. He is the one who started this journey, drive the car, of faith. And he is the one who completes this journey of faith. Hebrews 12, 2. Huh. That's right. Now, Hebrews, I, I let me just... You guys, coffee, you brew the coffee, so he brews the coffee, okay? Some of these guys didn't get that. I had to explain it for them. All right, hey, we hope you have an awesome day at, at Virtual Bible School, and we will see you at the end. See you later.
just can't find them. Oh, hi friends, I'm Manny. I have this super cool 3D book, and when I have these 3D glasses, I can see super cool things. Like this one time, when I was looking in the book with my glasses, I saw a spider. It looked like it was gonna crawl right up on my nose. This other time, I saw a frog. It looked like it was gonna jump right up on my head. 3D glasses are super cool. I just wish I could find mine. Who? Who? Hey, it's Ollie. Hello, Manny. Who? Who? Looking at something fun, are you? Hi, Ollie. Well, I can see all kinds of cool things in this book when I have my 3D glasses. <sighs> but I can't find them. Looking at pictures is fun, it's true. And I know someone you can look at too. Let's listen to this story. Just follow me through. Who? Who? Follow me through. The place where we look and we look and we see what's in the Bible. Are you ready to look inside the mystery box and see what we can learn from the Bible today? If you're ready, on the count of three, yell, take a look. Ready? One, two, three. Take a look. Wait a minute. It's another box. In box. Aside, another box? That's funny. <laughs> okay, here we go. Whoa! Look at all this dress up stuff. Do you like to play dress up? <laughs> I know what this is for. This is going to help us learn about talking to God because Jesus is our good friend. He wants us to know how to talk to God. And it's right here in the Bible. Let's play dress up! Okay, hear ye, hear ye. If you want to talk to God, you must wear the fanciest clothes and only use the biggest, fanciest words. Is that true? No way! We can wear anything and use any words to talk to God. Okay, what about this? You have to use a megaphone so God can hear you. Hello, God! Is that true? <laughs> no way! God hears us when we whisper or shout or use our inside voice. <laughs> okay, you have to be in a special place to talk to God. Is that true? No way! You can talk to God anywhere. The playground, your room, even when you're riding in a car. Jesus said you can talk to God anytime, anywhere, about anything. Wow, that's awesome! We can talk to God when we want to say thank you. Thank you, God, for the fish and this day. <sighs> we can talk to God when we want to say, I'm sorry. God, I'm sorry I didn't share with my sister today. We can talk to God when we need help. God, I feel afraid when it's dark outside. Can you help me be brave? We can talk to God when we want to tell him how awesome he is. Let's tell him right now. <gasps> On the count of three, say, God, you are awesome. Ready? One, two, three. God, you are awesome. <laughs> Jesus taught us we can talk to God anytime, anywhere, about anything. He taught us how we can talk to God because he's a good friend and he loves us so much. In fact, 
Jesus loves us so much, he wants to be our friend forever. <laughs> oh, hey there, Ollie. Tell me, who wants to be your friend forever? Jesus wants to be my friend forever. Yes, it's true. Now, let's hear it from you. Tell me, who wants to be your friend forever? Jesus wants to be my friend forever. That's the truth, friends. You better believe it. See you tomorrow on another Look and See. Bye! <laughs> so there's your story, and it's all true. Jesus taught us we can talk to God. Who? Thanks, Ollie. Goodbye to you. Who? Who? I love that we can talk to God anywhere, anytime, about anything. I think I got story. Did you get it? If you did say got it, get it? Got it! Good! 3D books and glasses are super cool, but I don't need to wear anything special to talk to God. In fact, I'm going to talk to him right now. I'll see you guys next time. Bye! Hey, Park Kids, how was your lesson today? We learned about the Lord's Prayer. And that's something that you can remember your entire life as an example of how we pray. Jesus gives an example to us in the scripture of how we can pray. And remember the bottom line today is that you can pray anytime, anywhere, and about anything. That's right, you can talk to God and you could pray to him and you could talk to him about anything and you could do it anywhere and you could do at about anything. And to help us remember the bottom line, I have the crew here today and we're gonna play a game that we call What's in the Bag? Yeah! They're really excited about this game. So this is what we're gonna do. We have identical bags. You can get the bag on the table. They cannot look in the bag, but they're gonna have about one minute. We're gonna put a timer on for one minute and they're gonna feel around in the bag without looking. And then they're gonna try to write down and identify as many things as they can, they can in the bag. Are you ready? Yeah! Here we go. Five, four, three, two, one, go. No peeking, just feel around. No peeking. 
Blue team, turn around so we can see you. Are you looking at the back? I want to see your back. That's all right. If you can play this game at home, you and your brother, your sister, mom, dad, you can just get a bag or you can get a box and you can put a bunch of stuff in it and then you can you can test your brother or your sister or, or whoever you want in your family and you can find really fun, maybe crazy things that you can find in the house and see how you do with the game. We're getting about down to the timer. All right, you got 10 seconds and I'm gonna give you 10, nine, Eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. All right, here we go. You got your answers. All right, come back up closer to me. Here we go. This is what was in the bag. Self score. See if you get them right. We had a bottle of slime. We had a walkie talkie. We had a flag, a pair of sunglasses. There was a toy dinosaur. There was a paper clip. Missed that one. A popsicle stick. There was a crayon. A crayon. There was a pop tart. You guys didn't get the pop tart. And there was a rubber ducky. Yeah. <laughs> All right. How many did you get? But you tied. All right. Hey, how'd you do at home? We hope you, you played along with us. If not, when the video's over, have fun playing What's in the Bag. And we will see you tomorrow. See you later.